When Francis Lee joined Derby County, he had already won a league title, the FA Cup, the League Cup, the European Cup Winners' Cup, and had 27 England caps to his name, including featuring at the 1970 World Cup. His capture by manager Dave Mackay in the summer of 1974 was a stroke of genius, and it would bring Lee another Football League winner's medal. Born in Lancashire in 1944, Francis Lee played for just three clubs. His career began at Bolton Wanderers. He spent eight years there before moving to Main Road, where he became one of the most prolific goal scorers in English football history. At the age of 30, he joined Derby, where his goal scoring exploits continued and helped the Rams to their second title in 1975. On his return to Manchester, Lee scored one of the most famous goals ever captured by the match of the day cameras. Lee, interesting. Very interesting. Oh, look at his face. Just look at his face. Lee led the celebrations at Bailey's nightclub in Derby when the Rams were confirmed as champions. the right way to win it with a champagne glass in your head. I think so, yeah. yeah. I can't think of any better way. <laughs> in what was his final season in English football, Lee continued to hit the headlines, though not always for the right reasons. And it looks to me as if it's broken out again. It's broken out again and now this time a complete free-for-all. Lee and Hunter were walking across to the far side and it all started all over again. And I'm sure they must have been sent off this time anyway. In typical fashion, Francis Lee rounded off his playing career in a 6-2 win at Ipswich Town on the final day of the season. Up goes Lee. Lee coming again. And Charlie's being held back and scored. It's a goal by Francis Lee. Lee was a successful businessman in retirement and in 2016 was awarded a CBE for services to football and to charity. Francis Lee made 80 appearances for Derby County, scoring 30 goals in two seasons. Though he will mainly be remembered for his association with Manchester City, his short time at the baseball ground will never be forgotten.